Mr. MSU is another long-standing tradition on campus. It's not every day you see college men prancing around on stage in their formal wear. Some of these ladies in charge of the 31st annual Mr. MSU gave us a behind-the-scenes look into one of the most entertaining pageants of the year. Mr. MSU is no small production. In fact, many people spend countless hours planning this well-known event. While attending Mr. MSU's dress rehearsal, we were able to learn how it all comes together. Mr. MSU is a male pageant we put on every year. This is our 31st year. It is all to go towards our philanthropy, which is arthritis research. Um, last year we raised over $8,000, so we're hoping to even do better this year. I have been planning this since last November scheduling everything, getting all the guys together. Hannah has been a wonderful assistant. She has done anything I've asked her to, helping with the program and designing the tickets and even helping me get participation. Students are always encouraged to get involved on campus and Mr. MSU allows students that opportunity. The more involved you are, the more you get to learn about, the more you get to give back and I think that's one of the most important things you can do is to give back to the community and that's what we try to do and that's what this event is all about is to try to give back and raise money. Um, we take a picture of all the guys legs but you don't have a picture of their face so people can come by the Curse Center and drop in money and that's a way for the guys to get points. Whoever gets the most money in their jar gets um, an added points to their score. Um, also we have ticket sales. They're five dollars. They're being sold all week at the Curse Center um, and then the night of the show they're seven dollars at the door. I hope people can really um, have a good time but also see what ALP is about and how much we love arthritis and how we just want to raise money for it and help as many people out with it as we can.